hi everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel so today it's all a video about how to start a youtube channel and how to edit your video in canva or in filmora x so first of all today i'm going to walk you through the process of creating a channel it's a it's the most easiest part of uh, maintaining a channel because it's the most easiest easiest part so without any further ado let's get into the video so the as i told you before the first part of maintaining a youtube channel is creating a youtube channel so you don't need anything but an account so and you might have noticed that i have uh, i have already started a youtube channel but I'm also going to walk you through like um, I'm gonna add another account and show you how to create um, a, a Google account so yeah and password and then you get your own chrome so then just go to the youtube then you get this page the youtube page and what you have to do is click on this right hand side icon and they, they actually show you your channel so you have to go into that and then you find your channel but I have started my channel one year before so it's already here but when you are putting into a new thing or you're going into a new account then the, there wouldn't be these kinds of things instead there will be like your account or your accounts name in it and you could customize and do everything like that you could delete your videos you can edit them whenever you want there's no rules uh, that there's in youtube but you have to follow one rule do not put copyright content in your music or in your content so just keep it in mind and even if you put copyright content in the co your content um, then your your channel gets banned and you'll be not able to put any, any more videos in your um, YouTube channel so just keep that in mind because it is a very serious situation so when you use a music you only have to use music music like uh, let me show you copyright free music um, then you get all of these musics and stuff and you're just able to do something so and also when you use the um, when you when you use the copyright free music or copyright free content then you should also add the link as i did in my in my youtube channel so another main thing for um, for maintaining youtube channel is tags so i'll be showing you one of my latest videos tags so to show you that how to increase your youtube's um, views and stuff like that so yeah let's go to my videos studio and here you go you get the title which i put it as nine stationary faves that is worth buying and i would always recommend you to do editing more not like me i am keeping it minimal because i love love it when it's minimal but if you are a person who love it when it's so grand and stuff like that you could add flowers and stuff and you could edit it in canva i will definitely make a video how to do a thumbnail in it so it will be as easy as making a youtube channel so just don't worry about creating a youtube channel because if you fear of starting a YouTube channel, then you may never create it. So the first step for you to do that is do not be afraid. So that's the first step. Then only all these content and stuff like that comes. So 
the first part is the title the title has to be catchy and uh, attractive and then you have your description box mm, this this is the this is the place where you insert links and names the the copyrights like uh, like i i told here that app used to edit filmora x and the music is the music is provided by the filmora program so we don't get copyrighted in that thing so i add this in every single video and i also add my check my blog in every single video so and i also have listed here the names of the products if it, no, some some people didn't understand or did, it was they was not able to hear it or something they could definitely come here to check it out and stuff like that so the next part of this, the most important part is the clickbait or the part which is very it has to be really very really, really attractive as you could see here this thumbnail that i have uploaded for this is not even attractive i know that but i really don't care about it because uh, if it's too kachambucha then it would be really hard to read and stuff so i didn't add a lot of decorations to it but if you want you can definitely add them so most important part is the thumbnail so you have to make it fancy good looking and attractive to you yourself and the playlist is not an important part but if you want it then you could definitely do that too so the basically you have to click on new playlist and create a title and then public private or unlisted or something like that so that's the basically the thing so so yeah and the next the second most the first most like second most important part of the uploading of your youtube video is your tags so you gave your title as nine stationary faves then that that might not be the title that the exact person wants to search so there might must be like synonyms or any other alternative word for that single for that single word so um, you might kind of want to search the what people mostly search or something like that here i put in hashtag stationary hall hashtag stationary essentials hash, hashtag stationary faves hashtag affordable stationary recommendations because these are kind of keywords that most people um, want to search and want to know about so if you are a person who has experience of searching yourself for this content then you might know that so every single person search is for even even me i search for desk setup or desk organization and stuff like that and it shows up like this so i thought about it and the tags are the most important part of your video because this is where your your customers or your subscribers will be able to find your channel according to these tags and the next is the language and caption certification you could just add your captions here but i didn't add it because i i kind of don't want the captions and then recording data and location i didn't actually put it but the video location is where like in chennai or in dubai or in america uh, anything like that and recording date where when did you record this at 17 or 18 like dates and then license you don't need anything to be done this side because there's nothing to be done in this side but hello uh, embedding is the most the, the third most important thing because um, embedding means sharing so without clicking this icon will be no one will be able to share your videos which will not reach any views so please make sure that this icon on this button is always on this is the category so there are so many categories that come in comedy and entertainment politics education science and technology everything like that so mine is education um and if you are uploading like study vlogs or any other kinds of vlogs then you could definitely go to people and blogs so yeah this is the category and the next is the um actually the important part actually because uh, without this you'll be not able to know what your subscribers want exactly so it's good for you to have um means to remember to turn this 
turn all the comments on because you have to allow all the comments to be in your YouTube YouTube video so that's the thing and the last is show how many viewers like and dislike this video this is not important if you don't want to know how many people want likes for you or dislikes for you then you can definitely turn this off but if you want to know how many viewers like your content and dislike your content you can definitely on this thing so this is the whole um like making the video kind of thing so yeah this is the whole process now i'm going to save it and now all the changes are saved and now product media means you have to go to your channel and here's the option called create and if you click this option called upload video then you will get this file and you could select the files from your computer and upload on this so that's not a big deal but now that we know how to upload a video and how, what are the things that the most important in this kind of thing so yeah this is the main thing and then want to know how what are the total views or total things like that then you have to go to youtube channel and so what you have to do is go to your youtube channel and then you have to go to the customized channel some pens actually skipped then go to analytics then here you have the clear overview of views you got and how much it has increased and decreased it has increased and decreased so now i've got um one subscriber because i've um, i had 32 and now i got 33 so this is because i uploaded shots a lot in my exam time so i'm um, i got 458 3k views and some things some things like that so yeah so these are the videos and stuff so this is the um, reason analytics is very important so you need to know um how your analytics work so yeah guys this is the um whole process of starting a youtube channel and maintaining it so the main main tip is to not upload too many videos in one week if you upload like four videos in one week then the people may get annoying and turn off the notifications or kind of um unsubscribe to your channel so you don't want to do that so just upload one video for one week as i did today i only uploaded uh one video like two videos at least maximum you have to upload two videos and minimum you have to upload one video because yeah guys so um uh, this week i uploaded two videos which is how to be more productive and nine stationary faves that is worth buying so next week i'm going to upload this video and another video about how to do the editing in canva and uh in flamora x and the next week i'm going to upload how to make a thumbnail and how to make it more fancier so these are the this is the plan and if you want to know more content or know more things in about myself or about how to make a youtube channel or anything like productivity study vlog be free to comment in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe like and share so Yeah. So bye guys. Meet you in the next video and don't subs don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Bye guys.